Welcome to My Steel Insights. I'm Adela. As we approach the end of September, China's steel market is experiencing a significant rebound after months of stagnation. According to My Steel's chief analyst Wang Jianhua, the market is poised for a robust October, fueled by government stimulus, enhanced sentiment, and shifting the supply demand dynamics. Recently, China's composite steel price rose by around 150 yuan per ton, reaching nearly 3,570 yuan per ton, largely due to a central government stimulus package introduced on September 24th. Wang notes that these stimulus measures have surpassed expectations, generating optimism throughout the economy. This wave of positivity has led to recoveries in both the stock and property markets. Bolstering consumer confidence. Additionally, lower interest rates and a reduced reserve ratio from the People's Bank of China are providing crucial support to businesses. With steel inventories also declining significantly, total stocks of major carbon steel products in 35 cities have dropped by 2.7 million tons since late August, reaching their lowest level since December 2022. Wang anticipates that inventory of construction steel will decrease by approximately one million tons in October, even with potential supply increases. Looking forward, after the National Day holiday from October the first to seventh, steel makers are expected to ramp up production as rising prices enhance profitability. My steel data reveals that as of September the twenty seventh, eighteen point six of blast furnace mills are profitable. Up from just 3.9 percent on August the 30s, indicating growing industry confidence. Wang also foresees a post-holiday surge in raw material demand, as steelmakers have been less proactive in stocking iron ore this year, compared to last year's pre-holiday purchase of nearly 15 million tons. This year's total was only 6.5 million tons. This shift suggested that demand for raw materials will rise after holiday. Potentially pushing prices higher and reinforcing support for the steel market.